water in this village of ours is the most important priority. Over one billion people on the planet don't have access to clean drinking water. That's huge. EWB at Montana State is working on a water and sanitation project in the western region of Kenya that will provide all 56 primary schools with clean water and improved sanitation. In many cases, the girls have to leave class and carry five gallon buckets on top of their heads and you know, haul them back from maybe a mile away, maybe farther. In most cases, they're still dirty water sources. And so they're missing tons of school, you know, up to one to two hours a day, which in the end, that puts them so far behind their male counterparts. When we thought about it, we saw it was wise for us to write a proposal to assist our girls uh, that are being affected uh, during class time going out to look for water as, as we boys uh, continue with our lessons. And that is why we decided that we need to write a proposal, we all boys of Shirali Primary, and that is when we landed on EWB. A lot of the engineering work happens while we're here at MSU. And then when we go, 90% of what we're doing is just basic implementation and then a lot of education. Everything we do hinges on the community being involved and knowledgeable and excited about what we're doing. We are drilling wells at schools which are centralized locations. That's a, a major benefit for the young girls and the women because then they don't have to worry about where to go to get water. The families know like, wow, you know, now you're giving my daughter an opportunity to get an education that my son got. And that's really a neat thing. goals for the project are lofty. Um, we want to see a lot of change. We have been introducing composting latrines to address the issue of adequate sanitation. The current structures are pit latrines that require that they are moved often. It creates a lot of labor. Permanent composting latrine, it's a larger permanent structure that we can incorporate hand washing stations into. The best part about it is that it creates a usable byproduct. The human feces over time is turned into compost, which can be used and spread over fields. Any technology that we introduce there needs to become vital and needs to provide something for the people. And fertilizer is something they need. Only half of what we're doing is helping people that are asking for help. The other half of what we're doing is helping students in the U.S. realize that, that they can make a difference. That's wonderful. <laughs> it's really given me insight to life and what it's like to actually oh, do something like that's meaningful. <laughs> I feel like that I've surprised myself, like, wow, I've been a part of something big and something bigger than I thought I could be a part of. Let's spin it over and get it back. I've learned a lot. <laughs> I learned more in the one month in, that I was in Kenya than I had in a couple of years of school prior. And it's really helped me become motivated to uh, really dive into school. Our plans for the future are to help as many schools as we can, as quickly as we can, without sacrificing the sustainability of the project. I think the community is doing what they can to provide their end of the deal, but ultimately 
we have to raise a lot of money here in the States in order to make these projects happen. It would basically cost about a million dollars to provide 56 schools um, with wells. And those 56 schools are surrounded by a community of 120,000 people. It's just a matter of whether or not the people who have are willing to make a little bit of a sacrifice to help the people who don't have it get on their feet so they can start focusing on other issues. Nothing can express the, the way your heart fills up when you see water come exploding out of the ground from this well that's being drilled from the money that you worked so hard to raise. And so many generous people donated. And to them, it means so much more than any amount of money could probably mean to most of us here. <laughs> 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 <laughs>